Oh my god. You guys better watch till the end of this, okay? Seriously. Seriously. Because I got some good drama for you. Okay. <laughs> Hey guys, oh my god, I missed you guys so much. Um, I have been so sick, like, the last week, no joke. Um, I figured this would be good to, like, have behind me for my videos, like, so I could, like, block every, you know, like, whatever. But, uh, <laughs> then I brought it out and had, like, a breakdown because, alright, so I guess it's gonna be, like, a mixture of... A combination of things in this video. Um, I guess I'll start with where this came from. Uh, my ex, my ex, he was in the military. Um, I'm like still heartbroken over this. His name is Mike, um, Mike Jarvis. <laughs> and, um, Like, alright, so it's like really hard for me to talk about. So I'm just going to spit it out real quick. He was my first boyfriend ever, okay? And then um, he got deployed to Afghanistan when I was pregnant. And um, we started talking. And he was there for me throughout my pregnancy. And I was there for him when he was in Afghanistan. Hardest thing ever, oh my god. Imagine being on the phone with somebody you love and like you hear bombs going off in the background. Like, fuck, dude. But, um... Yeah, so pretty much what happened was Trevor got out of prison and everybody was like, you need to give him another chance. You have to give him another chance. If you don't, you're going to regret it. That's um, that's Tyler's father. You know, you have to at least try to make a family. I had a lot of pressure on me. So I, I didn't want to break up with him but like I needed to just see what was gonna happen and I was hoping that he would just bear with me for a couple weeks no no um he ended up hating me pretty much um but like I really just needed some time you know what I mean like and I wish like I ended up relapsing too when we were together and um so I understand like that our our relationship when we were together was kind of messy but I don't know I don't know I mean he moved on real quick and is like engaged now and <laughs> holy like really like it's like well that's nice like I wonder how long he was talking to this girl like, was he talking to her when we were together? Probably, because they got together, like, right after me and him broke up. But, yeah, this is from him from Afghanistan. So, pretty much, like, it still hurts all the time. All the time, you guys. Like, <laughs> like, and sometimes I just wish he would, like, like, at least be my friend. You know what I mean? Like, I wish he would at least be my friend and talk to me. Like, fuck. You know what I mean? Like, he was my friend forever. And it's, I don't know. I'm kind of just babbling. You guys, like, don't need to... It's alright. It just, uh... Sucks. Like, when you really care about somebody and you really love somebody and you make a mistake and they just, like, completely blow you off like you like I'm assuming that he never really loved me when he said that he did because if he did he, he wouldn't have been so easy for him to just get over me and like go on to another girl like that's my cat <gasps> kitty you knocked out my backdrop <laughs> you know what screw it Hold on. I'm just gonna leave it Right like that. See, maybe everything happens for a reason. Yeah, TT. Now you're stuck under there. Not my problem. <laughs> She's like literally like stuck under there. 
Can't. All right, there you go. Anyways. All right. Anyways, so yeah. Um, sucks. You guys should all send him a message on Facebook because he has me blocked. And you should be like, Gina's famous now. <laughs> you should talk to her. Be like, you should talk to her. You should talk to her. You should talk to her. All of you guys. I need like 20 of you to message him and be like, you should talk to her. <laughs> uh, just for that closure, you know? Like, I really did. I never got closure, which sucks. But anyways, I'm going to move on. I'm going to move on with this. <laughs> um, anyways, so... I'm gonna put a couple polls throughout this video because I want to know like if you guys want to see certain things um I got a package in the mail from Adam and Eve um I don't know if you guys would be interested in seeing any of that um I also got these two palettes and the reason that I got them I didn't uh I don't know. The subculture one that everybody hated, and the Huda Beauty Desert Dusk palette that everybody hated. And the reason that I got them was because a lot of people were saying that they hated them because of certain shadows. Like, like, um, apparently, like, like, apparently, like, this one. So Alright, so, like, here's the thing, is if you're going to spend $65 on a palette, you you should know like what these shadows are like I'm pretty sure that those are toppers like shadow toppers that's why they don't work like regular eyeshadow but maybe I'm wrong um the subculture one uh I did try it one time so far and I did not have any issues with it no problems so I mean yeah there's a little bit of fallout but like can you really even tell not really, but that's what happens when there's like super pigmented, you know, which they are. But hmm, I'm gonna I'm gonna give it a shot a couple more times. I liked it though. I thought it was okay. You just gotta, you know, practice. But anyways, um, if you guys want to see a video about with those, let me know. Um, yeah, I'm just going to scatter some polls throughout here and see what you guys want to see. But I really do miss you guys, and I love you guys all so much. Now, let's see. Let's get into the drama. That's why I know why you guys are here. Let's see. Let's check out the internet. I'll be back. Oh, my God. Y'all better sit down because I got a ton of drama for you now. All right. I'm just getting myself ready. Let's, where do I even start? Oh my God, okay. <laughs> Trisha Paytas, new rap god. Actually, her rap is not that bad. Not that bad, okay? Not that bad. It's uh, on her channel, go check it out. I'm not gonna play it on here because I'm not getting another copyright. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm surprised. I'm surprised. But, um, let's see. Ooh, I got a book here. Uh, Jake Paul roasting rice gum. Why? Why? Aren't you supposed to be his daddy? Why are you roasting your son? I don't know. Whatever. I, I don't, I don't know. I like, I like rice gum. I think that Jake just needs to, like, kind of back off. And he admitted in the interview that, um, well, first he said that he gave some random girl, listen to this, he said he called her a random girl. He gave a random girl a career and a place to live, and then, like, right after, they were like, well, did you love her? And he was like, yeah, I did. Oh, except for you just called her a random girl, like, what? Let's see, um, Vine 2.0 is coming back. Anyone gonna be there? Probably not. <laughs> um, let's see, Meek Mill? Going to jail? That's crazy. Like, I guess, like, this judge, like, has it out for him. Like, literally. Like, it's no joke. Like, he's, they're literally, like, out to get him. That's 
Like, dead serious. It's messed up. But, um, you guys can do research on that. Uh, let's see. Um, Tana, Tana Mojo, Tana Mongoose, um, is at it again with her crazy problematic behavior. And the best video to check out for that is probably going to be, um, Peter Mons, because, like, his exact words were, uh, when she posted her video about the bruises, like, obviously, like, he said it best. Obviously, if you are partying to the point where you're, like, blackout drunk and fucked up, then, um, yeah, you're gonna have random bruises. <laughs> and, uh, but he, Peter said, um, you know, either show all the truth or don't show it at all. Which I think is true. I mean, she's not obligated to tell us anything. I mean, but still, like, if you're going to tell, like, a half-truth, you might as well just tell the whole truth or just don't say anything. That is true. Um, there's a lot of drama going on. Let's see. Oh, and who was right about the... Hold on. Who was right about the Kylie Jenner brushes? Makeup by Shayla was the only person who tried to wash them, like on camera. Let me show you what happened to those brushes. <laughs> Dude, it's so messed up. Let's see. Where's my screenshots? Um. Ah, oh, come on. Where is it? Really? Now I can't. Hold on, I'm looking for the picture. Oh, right there. I'm just gonna let that focus in. Hold on. Come on. Come on. Wow! After one wash. Now remember, this is the girl who compared herself to Kevin Aquan. <laughs> what? Like, I don't know. I don't even know anymore. Alright, I'm really sick, guys. As you can see, I am not with it. I'm on, like, a lot of medication right now. Not, like, because I'm sick, but, um, yeah, so I'm gonna go, and I need to go take a nap, I love you guys so much, seriously, and, um, yeah, I'm gonna, once I, once I start feeling better, I'm gonna go back to uploading every day, should I do vlogmas, like, in vlog, maybe if I had a camera, like, <laughs> vlog with what are good vlogging cameras what's the camera that Shane and Shane Dawson's last video he got a camera for his son what kind of camera was that can anyone find out for me and let me know and find out where I can get one for cheap or um, if somebody just wants to mail one to my P.O. box I'll leave it down below <laughs> no but um yeah uh, yeah, that's it. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Love you. Bye.